So in order to fix the battle.net installation error, it's actually very simple. So the first step we need to take is by going to the battle.net website. I'll leave a link in the description. We want to go ahead and click on this button here, where it's going to go ahead and download the battle.net installer. So do that now. Okay, so now we've got our battle.net installer uh, downloaded to our Windows computer. We do not want to run it just yet. We've got a couple more things to do. So the next step is to click on our Windows icon in the bottom left. I want to type in add or remove. I want to go ahead and click on add or remove programs. Now you notice the settings application will load up and what you want to do is scroll down this list here and you want to go ahead and find battle.net which is here. And you want to go ahead and click on uninstall and click on uninstall again. Now this will only uninstall the battle.net program and not any games I have installed to your computer so this is completely safe. So now we've uninstalled the battle.net program we just need to go ahead and remove a couple of more files that have been left over. This means that when we go ahead and reinstall battle.net, it's going to be a truly clean installation of the program. So to do this, we just need to go ahead and right click on our Windows icon in the bottom left, and you want to go ahead and click on run. You then want to go ahead and type in percent program data percent and click on OK. Now once you've done this, you want to go ahead and find the two files called battle.net and Blizzard Entertainment, and you just want to go ahead and delete these. Now again, I'm not going to delete this because I've already fixed the issue. Once we've done that, we just need to go ahead and do the same thing again. So right click on our Windows icon, click on Run. And this time you want to go ahead and type in percent app data percent and click on OK. And then you want to go ahead and find the file called battle.net. And again, you want to go ahead and delete it. So now we've fully removed the program from our computer and the remaining files that have been left over. We can now go ahead and run the installer. So you just want to right click on the installer and it's important that you run it as the administrator. You then want to go ahead and follow the install process just like normal and your battle.net should be working completely fine with all your games that have been installed to your computer. And that is all you need to do to fix the installation error for battle.net. So if this video is helpful please leave a like and pass on to someone who may find it helpful as well. If you have any questions or comments just leave them below and I'll reply to you as soon as possible. So thank you for watching and have a good day.